Extrusions are taken from their racking location and then brought over to the hanging station. Parts are taken from their bundles and placed onto the racks. Parts are hung on the racks in various ways to ensure the best coating. Parts then enter the wash and dry system where they are prepared to be painted. Any excess water is then removed from the parts before they enter the drying oven. Before the parts are painted, the spray booth needs to be cleaned and repaired for the parts. Once the spray booth has been cleaned, the parts are checked to make sure that they have no foreign materials on them before being painted. Paint is then added to the hopper and the spray booth is ready to start painting. Before the parts are painted, the guns are activated. Once the guns are activated, they are checked to see if they are spraying appropriately and that the parts will be covered. After the initial test, the parts are then painted. As the parts are being painted, they are checked to see if there are any noticeable variations in the paint coverage. If there are any discrepancies, the guns are then adjusted at the painting controls. After the coating has been applied, the parts are then measured before entering the curing oven to determine if they need to be repainted or not. If the parts are acceptable, they then enter into the curing oven and come out the other side when they are finished. 